Okay, um, I'm going to show you the ELK. ELK meaning Elastic Search, uh, Lagstash, and Kibana. So this one, it has a APM, it has a logging, it has a metrics, it has a security analytics, and this one is an open source and it's free. Okay. Uh, there are so many things in this uh, application and once you start using it, you will enjoy it. I enjoy using it because it's very, I can use it pro from my uh, uh, laboratory. So here in management, you can see here Elasticsearch and Kibana. You can create, uh, there's an option here to create index. If you create, click uh, create index pattern and let's say, see, uh, let's say you can, I have already existing one that I created before for demo purposes, I will create a new one. So we have here Lugstash, so let's say, imagine I have uh, so many lugs, I will search uh, Lugstash lugs that are starting from this text and it will show all of them. So I'm going to select the May one, okay, then timestamp, then create index pattern, okay, it will um, display now as a drop down list in our um, in our Kibana we'll go to discover in the discover option we have here the log stash that we created so from here it will show all the logs so there's an option here to change last 15 minutes today this week this month this year you can you can customize your view. Um, let's say we're going to search uh, the host uh, 10.128.1.3. This is our switch, Cisco switch. So in this one, it will show all the logs related to this switch. So we can see here interface port 7, change to up. Okay. Let's try to make a new change and see what will happen if we can see the logs. Okay, we're going to log in on the switch. Then we're going to make a change. Username Arnel. We'll put our password. config t interface 011 we're going to shut this interface and see if we will see anything from our syslog server let's go into refresh this box click last 15 minutes and refresh see we have port 11 change state to administrative down so our syslog server is working fine this tool is very cool because it's open source and it's free. I can use this one in my lab and you can, we can use also in our data center or in our infrastructure. See, the logs is working fine. Show log, see it, it's pointing to our, I'm using port 514 to send the logs. So we can see here, configured and consoled by Arnel. Okay, that means uh, user account, Arnel, the one who make the change. So we're, we're, let's try to query again. Okay. console by Arnel. So we can see here in the message configured from console by Arnel. That is the username. 
and the uh, IP is 10.128.1.31 so let's check the IP address of our machine if it's that .31 yeah it's that uh, .31 so that means the logs are working fine let's go into filter so we'll put the hose 10.128.1.3 Yeah, that three, then that one twenty eight, that one that three save then let's put um, add filter again this time we'll put message is Arnel see it's showing you can filter the logs you can see here what time it was changed this tool is very nice I like it let's try to make a change again this time we're going to change the port 12 interface F1012 Let's do a range from port 11 to port 12. Sh let's shut this range, okay. Let's see, refresh. See, it's showing here 12 and 11 are administrative down. Cool, I like this. no shut and do right ma'am let's see okay it's working our tool is working these are the information that uh, we're getting okay let's try to put my name again search I'll save it. Okay, yeah. We have the information that Arnell made the change. Okay. So Let's change it into today. Okay, all these are the today logs on our syslog. We are seeing a lot of here because I put uh, my firewall, my wireless controller. That's why we're saying, okay, let's try to query another device. Then that 128, that 255. The 254. Let's see if we're seeing lugs from this device. Okay, so let's refresh it. Okay, we are seeing the device and we can see here CPU, we can see here session, uh, disk. Um, so many things here a lot of things in the device and the model you know so many things here so this tool it's very powerful tool
syslog is working fine. Let's try their device. Um, let's check the username here. Let's check the username. Um, logout successful. See, we have here uh, username is admin on this uh, device and it was logged successfully. And we have the date, what time it was logged, what time it was logged out. All the information that we need are here. Very nice tool. Let's test the other device. Let's check um, my access point, my wireless controller. Click. Uh, okay. Refresh. Refresh. Okay. So wireless controller is there. Let's search um, admin account. Okay. We have the records. I hope. Um, you enjoyed this video. Um, next, my next project, um, I'm planning to um, build the security onion and also NetFlow analyzer. I will, I will use. I'm more interested now in net in open source. So uh, watch out for the next video and it will be very interesting. Thanks, I hope you, you enjoyed this video and click uh, subscribe button and click the bell so that uh, if I have any new video, you will be uh, notified. Thank you for watching this video.